Hello, everybody, and welcome to another Wellness Wednesday. My name is Carly Cooper, and I am coming at you from Instagram and from Facebook. And I wanted to say hi and happy Halloween. I hope you're having an awesome day so far. In light of Halloween, I am wearing a fascinator. It's pretty fascinating, isn't it? <clears throat> this is my attempt to get festive. Anyway, I want to come at you with another Wellness Wednesday, and I was supposed to do this last week, and I attempted a few times, and something wonky was happening with my internet connection. So I apologize for not putting this out there <clears throat> last week. But today, I want to talk about an essential oil that smells like black licorice. Do you have any idea what that is? It is fennel. Sweet, sweet fennel. I love this oil. So this is a great oil that you can use aromatically. So you breathe it in, put it in, drop in your palms, breathe it in. You can diffuse it. You can also use it topically. So that's putting it directly on the skin. Um, diluting it with a fractionated coconut oil is always a good idea. Or you can just put it on directly on the skin. Or you can also take this oil internally. And it's an amazing oil for so many reasons, and I'm going to share why. So like I said, it tastes and smells a little bit like black licorice, or if you're in a more festive mood, Zambuca. Um, but it supports healthy circulation, respiratory system, digestion, and metabolism. So this is an oil that's very strong and supportive of the body and very good for purifying. So... Let me share a couple ways that uh, fennel is, is good, can be used. So great for cramps and spasms on your muscles. So you can dilute it with, like I said, a carrier oil. I like to use fractionated coconut oil and rub it directly on the muscles that are feeling like they're cramping. So maybe it's like your calf muscles, you're getting a Charlie horse or something like that. Um, it's very good. We're moving into cough and cold season. So this is a really good uh, oil to use for cough and congestion. So you can dilute it, put it directly on your chest and on your throat if you are suffering from that. Hi, Kathy. Uh, you can, if you if you suffer from hunger pains, right? If you're if you're feeling really hungry or you've got a sweet tooth, fennel is an amazing oil to put in water. So just put a drop in your water or do a drop under your tongue, and it's going to help. Um, curb those hunger cravings and those sugar cravings, right? Those hunger pains. Also, it's great for PMS and menstrual issues. So you can take internally in a veggie cap, in water, under the tongue, or if you're having those cramps, then you can put it directly on your stomach. Just again, you can dilute it or put it directly on your stomach. Works wonders. It's also great for digestive issues. So you know, you fill in the blank there. If you're nauseous, gassy, colicky babies, if you're putting these oils on babies, which they're totally safe to do, but babies obviously have more sensitive skin. Um, so definitely, definitely dilute the oils first uh, before putting them on the baby. Or if you put the oils on the bottom of their feet, which is also a great way to help, um, definitely put socks on right after because babies, you know, they can put their feet, they have that flexibility and they put their feet in their mouth. So um, it's also a very calming oil. And um, from an emotional perspective, you know, I'm all about like, how do these oils help with our emotions? Because this was a big point of entry for me when I was suffering with anxiety and low mood and all of that kind of stuff. I turned to these oils because I didn't want to go on medication. I didn't feel like I needed to go on medication, but I needed some kind of support. So these oils have been a game changer for me and also a lot of the physical symptoms that, that came with my emotional stuff. Um, so fennel is the oil of responsibility, okay? And as a life coach and somebody who practices personal growth and development on the daily, I am all about taking personal responsibility for your choices, your actions, your reactions, you know, everything that we do in our life and the life that we create is our responsibility, right? We can't control everything, we can't control everybody, but we can always control how we react and how we respond. And we have to look at our role and how we take responsibility. 
in in the creation of of what that is so um fennel is a great oil if you feel like you're a victim to your circumstance if you tend to go down the victim mentality route um, if you have a lack of desire to improve your situation if you're feeling just sort of blah like you don't really have the passion anymore or you've lost it and you want to reignite that passion and that motivation then um Fennel is a great oil. Again, you could diffuse it, you could wear it topically, um, and it just really encourage you, encourages you and your soul to take full responsibility for your choices. It helps you understand and realize that you can handle anything that comes your way. It might not be pretty, you might not like it, you might not enjoy it in the moment, but you can handle it. And if you're somebody who feels, you know, you're you're focused on what was and your circumstances and you can't change that and you feel really paralyzed by shame <clears throat> or fear, excuse me, or you just want to get moving again, um, fennel again is a great one for that. Now, if you are like most humans on the planet and when you're feeling that fear or that shame, you might sabotage your efforts, right? So that could be in the form of a very common one is when people know that they should be eating better and exercising more, and they make this big lofty goal of wanting to lose weight or, you know, get healthier, and then they sabotage that, right, with unhealthy eating or addiction or whatever that looks like for you. Um, fennel is a really good oil to help you connect with your body and your desire. So like I said before, it helps to curb craving, helps to curb cravings, um, and also the desire to numb out, right? So many of us just, when life gets hard in whatever form that looks like for us, we just wanna numb out in some way, whether that's with food, whether that's with spending a lot, whether that's with TV, we just don't wanna face it, right? So fennel is a great one to support us if we're feeling that shame or we're masking or you know we just don't want to deal with things, it's a great one to diffuse, to breathe it in, to apply it topically. Again, just to help reignite the passion, help you take personal responsibility and help you move forward. So in order to do that, you can take a drop internally with water uh, under the tongue in a veggie cap. Um, also, if you're somebody who tends to emotionally eat. Um, Halloween is a very triggering evening for many people because, you know, those darn treats are so small. But when you have 20 of them, they're not so small anymore. So if that's you and you've got that hunger craving um, or sugar craving, um, definitely look into fennel or put it on your wish list if you don't already have it. Hi, Patricia. Nice to see you. Anyway, that's what I got for you today. Um, I do want to mention I will be back next Wednesday to do another Wellness Wednesday. Um, on we're, we're moving through the alphabet. Um, trying to think about what is next. I think maybe we might be on to frankincense, possibly. That would have been a good one for today, like kind of a play on Frankenstein. But um, let me just see. I don't I think I have it written. But I think we're on frankincense. Happy Halloween to you too. Do you like my little fascinator here? That's how I get festive when I have to do a live video. Um, but yeah, I hope you have an awesome Halloween. And uh, direct message me or comment either on Facebook or on Instagram. Find me. I'm, I'm there. Um, and let me know what you want to hear about. What oils are you curious about? Um, do you have any questions about how to, you know, shift negative thinking into positive results? I mean, I do that too with my coaching and I'm putting the final touches on my Get Shift Done Mastery course. So I'm going to be super excited to launch that really soon. Anyway, please share this if you know somebody who is interested in learning more about essential oils as a natural solution to feeling better both emotionally and physically. Um, I would love to reach to connect with you or somebody you know and uh, yeah, just help in any way I can. Anyway, be safe out there today, tonight, enjoy, and we'll catch you next week. Bye for now.